Reginald Cobham, 1st Baron Cobham of Sturborough, Knight of the Garter, born 1295 and who lived until 1361, was a medieval English knight and diplomat. He was the son of Sir Reynold Cobham by Joan, the daughter and heir of William de Vere. This Reynold was the second son of John de Cobham by his first wife Joan, the daughter of William Fitzbenedict. The family were based at Sturborough Castle, Lingfield, in Surrey. In his early life, he was employed on diplomatic missions. By 1334, he was a knight in the household of King Edward III and fought in the Scottish campaign against David de Bruce and then on the continent in the Low Countries and Brittany. In 1342, he was summoned to the House of Lords as Lord Cobham of Sturborough. In 1346, he was in the force under Edward III that attacked France, fighting at the Battle of Crecy and the protracted but eventually successful Siege of Calais. In 1352, he was invested as a Knight of the Garter and in 1353 appointed Captain of Calais, a position he held until his death. In 1355, he served under Edward the Black Prince in Aquitaine, taking part in his march to the Loire and his victory at the Battle of Poitiers, where he was credited by the French historian Jean Frossart with the slaying of the French knight Geoffrey de Charny. Reynold married Joan Barclay, by whom he could claim to be related to the noble families of Sutton, Dudley, Beauchamp, de Dispenser and Mortimer. The Cobham family, however, were well connected to the ruling families of England in their own right. He died in 1361, probably of the plague, and was laid to rest in an impressive tomb in Lingfield Church. He was succeeded by his son Reynold, the second Lord Sturborough.